the number of people that have been talking about the Jordan documentary that's going to be on ESPN on Sunday night at 9 Eastern time, 10-part documentary, The Last Dance. Maybe. Let's go. And anytime that there's old school sports center stuff from like 20 some odd years ago, there is a shot. There is a chance that there might be a sports center moment from my history that's brought out. And then I'll get all sorts of tweets. Hey, you had hair. You had this. You had that. And I'm like, yes, I had hair. But I also, <laughs> you know, there's also something called a fine wine. But at any rate, so the last dance is coming out. And this. Last Dance was not from this photograph right here. As you know, the Last Dance is about, in particular, the final Jordan team in Chicago, right? Yeah, that 97 Which is what I yeah. talked about on SportsCenter. But that photograph that we'll return to in a second, right there, <laughs> is from Jordan's final press conference as a bull the first time. When he retired the first time and shocked everybody he's going to go play baseball. Yeah, that's October now, 93. I covered that for Northwestern Medill School of Journalism. That's the first Jordan story I ever covered. Now, I'll tell this story before we get further down the road there. I've told it before. I'll tell it again now that we're on a new audience. Yeah, we got all new people. I love my wife, Susie Schuster. Love her. Love her. As you know, she sits in this chair, filling in as a guest host. She is the light of my life, three beautiful children. But before I knew her, at the Medill School of Journalism, I went and covered that press conference. Right there in the middle, I was one of the first people there, right in the middle. I looked straight, directly at the microphones that were set up where Phil Jackson and Michael Jordan were going to appear. And I made sure I was going to do it because I was covering it my first quarter at the Medill School of Journalism Northwestern after I graduated Michigan. But I left my post for like 30 seconds because I was in the print quarter and there was somebody in the television quarter a few months ahead of me because you went print quarter to television quarter at Northwestern. And she was drop dead gorgeous. And I just, <laughs> I just wanted to, it was my one opportunity to chat her up. Shoot your shot, so buddy. I left my post for 30 seconds before I went up to her and she was too busy and shut me down and I went back. A few weeks later, Sports Illustrated had a two-page spread, not this photograph right there, but a two-page spread from behind Jordan's microphone looking at the media crowd and I looked for myself in the middle and I wasn't there. I was uh. outside the edges where... Mm. My Medill School of Journalism television quarter colleague was stationed. And so Sports Illustrated took that photograph in the 30 seconds that I was yellowing. Okay? And I was so disappointed. It was a lose-lose for me. <laughs> now put the photograph up, Don. Today I wake up and I see this Sports Illustrated put that large photograph of the last dance out. And I'm like, could it possibly be taken from an angle where I'm back in my spot? So I zoom in, top left corner of that spot, where it would be right in the middle. There I am. Hey! hey. And look at that lid. Look, at, mean, the, look at the hair hanging, hanging over. For hair hanging down, Rich. Oh I'm in need God. of a haircut. No, I'm looking at notes, Don. This is way before hand, you know, yeah, 90, smartphones. 93. No 93. Yeah, this is no cell phone. I don't that. I'm taking notes. I am working. <laughs> I'm a student. Well, you were working, but. Journalist. Yeah, you were trying, working. Working trying, trying to work. Multiple. I was working it, but yeah. that's me working. <laughs> wow. Look great. at me. That's Look great. at that. Look at that. That's me. I mean, Rich. but you could see I dressed in a sport coat, I a mean, tie. Sure, because you never know who you're going to run into. Black suit, black tie. Thank you. <laughs> We're going to shot down by. <laughs> Very proud of myself. Great day today, man. Woke up, saw that photograph, and I'm thinking to myself, is it possible 
that that's from an angle that I uh, proof that I was there. There I was. Well, I you could be like that again, Rich. I can't even put my glasses on now. <laughs> no hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.